Today we're going to be eating death row inmates' last meals. Oh, yeah. Jesus, bro. What did you do? I broke too many play buttons. That's why I'm in jail now. Well, anyways, today we're going to be eating the strangest, most interesting last meal requests. Starting with Stacey Lawton. He was executed by lethal injection. On Christmas Eve in 1992, Stacey Lawton and two accomplices were burglarizing cars and trucks in the neighborhood. And they actually killed someone in the process, which got him the death sentence. His last meal was a plain cheeseburger and a big jar of pickles. That's a strange combination. Well, honestly, guys, cheeseburgers oftentimes do come with pickles on them. I don't know why you want the whole jar. Let me just try it. This is what he was doing. He got the burger, he put the pickle on it, he closed the burger, and then he bit it. I honestly think it tastes good. But as a last meal request, are you I really know, good? I know. There's so many other things. I don't know if I would pick this as my last meal, but guys, at the end of the video, all the boys and I are gonna be eating our last meals. If we were in jail and we were gonna get the death sentence, we're gonna show you guys what we would request. Oh, oh. Whoa. this looks amazing. Was this for one person? Yeah, wow. Well, one person ate all this. William Bonin, he asked for two pepperoni pizzas, one sausage pizza, chocolate ice cream, and three six packs of Coca-Cola and Pepsi for his last meal. That is massive. That's William Bonin was the freeway killer. He was an American serial killer, so he murdered 21 people, and he was speculated to have murdered at least 15 more people, but it wasn't confirmed. That is a lot of people. Honestly, I don't know why they give people last meal requests. When you've done something so messed up, why are you giving the guy ice cream? I think that they should just put him in a box. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. We got sausage pepperoni pizza. That looks so fire, bro. Pizza might be on my death row request. But the question is, did he put the ice cream on the pizza? Whoa. Maybe. I I will try it. Wow. I'm good. Good. Oh, oh, Jesus. Okay. How does it look? Not good. Not good? <laughs> All right. Not so bad. What if you did pizza, ice cream, and Pepsi? I don't think everyone's combining here, but it's worth a try. It's going to be good. Okay, nice. Oh, bite that, bite that. Oh, oh, my God. Yeah. It's not that bad. <laughs> Next meal. This is Eileen Warno. Instead of choosing a formal meal, Eileen opted for a singular burger and snacks from 7-Eleven. She then had a cup of coffee in which she poured on top of the meal. Why? She was a serial killer who murdered at least seven people between 1989 and 1990. Jesus Christ. She wanted the coffee poured on top. Oh, jeez, bro. It's soggy now. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude. That can't be good. I am not eating that, bro. Do you guys ever eat your burgers, like, upside down? Yeah, I do. I actually do. Oh, dude. I don't know about that one, boys. Why? Why are you still eating it? Oh, okay, we'll see Cam in a little bit. It's, no, it's bad. <laughs> Pretty bad. Whoa, it's interesting, all right? Let's just bring out the next meal. Oh, yeah. Is that oh. a cockroach? No, 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 that's all. Dude. This is Victor Fuger. Victor Fuger was a murderer and a robber who killed people, robbed places. Ultimately, he ended up in jail, got put on death row, and his last meal request was a singular olive with the pit in it. He believed that the pit would grow in his body and would help him pass into heaven. Is that how that works? Not if you've killed multiple people, I don't think. I don't want to do this. Are you going to swallow the pit, too? Because he swallowed the pit. I don't know what's happening. It might grow in your stomach. That's pretty freaking sick. You better eat that thing before you spend the night in the oh. slammer. Woo, shut up! Ah. Nope. I'm going to say that one is terrible. I didn't like that at all. Next meal. This next meal is massive. So we're going to snap, and it's going to be in front of us. Three, two, one. Wow. Hey! That's crazy. This was Ted Bundy. He requested a traditional steak dinner, over easy eggs, hash browns, toast, milk, coffee, juice, butter, and jelly. Wow, that is a full course meal, bro, let me tell you. Ted Bundy was America's most infamous serial killer. He confessed to killing 30 people. Wow. 30? 30 people. Oh my God. So he was obviously put on death row. This was his last meal request. After they gave him the food, he didn't eat any of it. None? What? So you guys already ate. You already broke the rule. Wait, so he can't even eat this? I mean, you know, we're gonna eat it. Okay, obviously Ted Bundy didn't eat it, Hell but yeah. we're gonna eat it. Yeah. How could he look at this and not eat it? Well, I mean, the guy was a freaking murderer. Maybe bro. he was nervous because he was about to die. All right, well, this one I would say is very good, except for the fact that he didn't actually eat it. All right, next meal. Hope you gentlemen liked your last meal because you're about to eat some. It's another busy day in Seattle.